because I run a government, but I also lead people. And the people have spoken. I am grateful to all the members of the National Assembly who voted yesterday affirmatively for the Finance Bill 2024 as amended on the floor of the House to incorporate the views generated through public participation. And following the passage of the bill, the country witnessed widespread expression of dissatisfaction with the bill as passed, regrettably resulting in the loss of life, destruction of property, and disagreeation of constitutional institutions. On my own behalf, and on behalf of these members and many other Kenyans, I send my condolences to the families of those who lost their loved ones in this very unfortunate manner. Consequently, having reflected on the continuing conversation around the content of the Finance Bill 2024, and listening keenly to the people of Kenya who have said loudly that they want nothing to do with this Finance Bill 2024, I concede and therefore I will not sign the 2024 Finance Bill and it shall subsequently be withdrawn, and I have agreed with these members that that becomes our collective position. 